<laughs> when God helped a man. The reason some people are struggling is because they have never been helped. They've never experienced help. When God puts you on the pedestal, on the table of help, everything begins to work for you. Even when you talk nonsense, men will be clapping. I saw a man helped by God. Solomon was helped by God. God made all his enemies to serve him. One of the first signs is that your enemy will begin to serve you. They will begin to help you. Those that were speaking against will mobilize themselves to begin to help you. People will begin to help you, especially your enemy. They will begin to serve you. As the help of God rests upon you, I decree, let your enemy and my enemy begin to serve us now. When you see somebody with certificate and the person is qualified in everything, all manner of training, the resume is excellent, but still nobody is taking the person for a job. And the embargo has been placed on that certificate. Are you getting what I'm saying now? When you see a young, young girls in the family, all of them are beautiful, none of them are getting married. They are beautiful but they are not getting married. It shows that satanic sanction or embargo has been placed on them. That is, there is a spirit that has been assigned to restrict any person that wants to help them. When embargo is placed on somebody's mind, the mind is limited. When this embargo is placed on somebody's business, no matter what you do, you cannot decide beyond a certain point. Am I talking to your spirit? When embargo is set on a young girl, no matter how beautiful she is, no man will love to marry her, but will love to have sex with her. And I will tell her sweet she is in bed, but she will never be good to, to, to bring it to the home. When embargo is placed on somebody's business, the person cannot say. When embargo is placed on somebody's womb, the womb cannot conceive. So when God wants to help a man, what does he do? He removes those embargoes. He removes those sanctions. He crushes the demons responsible for it. The power that's always contending with you, striving with you, fighting with you, in your destiny, he do away with them. He also placed an embargo on the demons. That this time they will see you but they can't reach you. <laughs> they will see your job but they cannot manipulate it anymore. I prophesy. Any occultic embargo, witchcraft embargo, satanic embargo, marine embargo, place on your job. Place on your shop, place on your destiny, place on your certificate, place on your womb, place on your destiny, place on yourselves, place on this ministry. I command the embargoes come fire. When a man is sanctioned, nothing works. He will bring all those things we work, but him nothing work. Anyone that is on any satanic embargo, in the name of Jesus, I command the embargo come fire in the name of Jesus. Any witch representing a demonic sanction in this ministry, in your life, in your family, I command fire to raise that witch. I command the restriction to fire. When embargo is on a man, he doesn't go forward. You see him going around. The wife will be the one pushing him. You know why he doesn't want to do anything? He's tired. He has done it many times, no result. Because he's been restricted. I prophesy in the name of Jesus. Every witchcraft restriction that you don't see. Demons are assigned to restrict you that you don't see. I decree let the fire of God raise them out of your life. That which they have denied your husband of. That which they have denied you of. That which they have denied your family of. In the name of Jesus, I command them and release. I command them and release.